Fox 4's Brianna Brownlee has been following this trial since the beginning and joins us live from the Lee County Courthouse with this ending tonight, Bree. Yes, Chris and Nadine, despite not getting that death penalty recommendation, state attorney Amira Fox, as well as Fort Myers Police Department, did say that they felt like this was justice and that they do have closure. Now, with all of this, they do also say that they want the community to remember the ultimate sacrifice that Officer Adam Jobbers Miller made because he was a hero. The jury having returned a verdict and finding you guilty of with his head down, anticipating his fate. Wisner Desmare, her judge Robert Branning, read the sentencing. The defendant will never again taste freedom. His view will be concrete walls and bars for the rest of his life. Life without parole for the murder of 29-year-old Fort Myers police officer Adam Jobbers Miller. Back in the summer of 2018, Officer Jobbers Miller went to work like he always did and responded to a robbery investigation on Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. Boulevard. While being questioned, Desmarie stole a phone and then took off on foot. Officer Jobbers Miller chased after him and was shot in the head and later died in the hospital. One thing I am sure of that the ultimate sacrifice made by Officer Adam Jobbers Miller on that July 2018 evening will never be forgotten. Desmarais defended himself in his capital murder trial. It was a difficult trial. The U.S. Constitution says that a defendant has the right to represent themselves. But his life was spared when the same jury that unanimously found him guilty recommended life without parole instead of the death penalty. We did seek the death penalty against this defendant but the jury did not make the unanimous findings necessary under the law at the time we tried this case. Before sentencing, Desmarais says he doesn't feel evidence was truly presented and that he was wrongfully prosecuted. So I asked attorney Mary Fox about this, and she says it's all in the evidence. Well, I mean, unfortunately for Mr. Desmarais, there's such a thing as police body cameras, and the evidence on, in this case was strong. I mean, his act of executing Officer Jobbers Miller was on body cam. Now officer now, Officer Jobbers Miller was a police officer under the Chief Diggs administration. And today, State Attorney Mira Fox did say she hopes that Chief Diggs is smiling down on the decision. Live from the Lee County Courthouse, Brianna Brownlee, Fox 4.